or not. Mm. At least I got the Balenciaga sweatshirt. She's like, this is poignant. Yeah. They like hit you, yeah? Um, I had one moment with, I was getting interviewed. Did you cry or something? No. <laughs> you that, was, that was just when Jill called. <laughs> no, because everyone keeps asking, like, what's it like to be going back to France? Mm -hmm. And I keep saying the same thing, like, oh, I'm not thinking about it at all. Mm -hmm. And, like, I'm lying to everyone because it's, like, the craziest thing that I'm going back to France. And I just cannot believe this is, like whole circle and I'm back here mm -hmm. and the reason like I went there was for this so like that's when I was just like this is real like I'm actually that's going sick. to a World Cup in France and I'll be back in Paris like it's just yeah. wild. Take those little personal moments for yourself because yeah. that's like you did go there and you sacrificed a lot and like took a huge risk mm -hmm. to go there and now it's like basically all paying off. Yeah. So that's stout. Like I wonder if the other older players feel this too. I feel like so much more stress this time. There's so much on the line. Mm -hmm. And like, even just as older players, like our opportunity to kind of like cement our legacy like within the group, like as right. a group. You like define yourself, I feel like in this big moment. I mean, there's honestly not a lot to lose, but I think I have so much to prove. A lot of people look at me as two different players with Portland and with mm -hmm. the national team. I can be the same Lindsay. Right. Like I know I can do that. I feel like I have like everything to prove all over again. All of us younger players, I think are just honored to be playing amongst you guys and then helping like cement a legacy for you guys. Be like tenacious and like go get that performance for everything for the right. team, you know. Before the first game of the World Cup, yeah. what's the last text message you're going to send? Probably Sue. It'll be like, you better be awake watching this. <laughs> Just like, <laughs> Probably be like emojis. What about you? Maybe my mom. My mom's still probably texting me, mm -hmm. trying to figure out where her yeah. seats are or if she's in the right she's stadium. Like, oh my god, did you put me down for tickets? <laughs> mom, like, they gave you the tickets. Yeah, you're on the bus, mom. <laughs> you're good. Just like knowing what all the other send-off series were like, like this one's so much bigger and better. <laughs> yeah. And everything seems to get like so much bigger and better, like every year. Uh, well, first of all, that was my first time in Times Square, so. Oh, <laughs> really? Like yeah. Well, it's always like that. that in, yeah. <laughs> yeah. It's like, oh, this is Times Square. It is always that hectic, but. Yeah, and then there was just like big screens with our names and pictures on it, which was awesome. You're gonna have like literally like every person in every bar is gonna be like watching the games. <laughs> it's like, so cool. It's so cool. Just like let the energy like get to you in that way. It's just like the best feeling. Mm -hmm. World Cup time. Crazy. It's a wrap. It's a wrap. Killed it. Boom. Oh. Slither up this bed.